Good morning. Good morning. How's it going? <laughs> Warming up with some coffee before the video. Just trying to get the energy levels up. Get the fix in. Get the fix in, honestly. <laughs> What's up guys, this morning I'm going to teach you how to make my world famous breakfast burrito taught by Bashir. And then we're going to go for a cool run in Venice. It'll be super cool, super iconic. It'll look like GTA. And I'll be running with Tyler and Tristan will be getting the six shots, as always. And honestly, this year I've been getting really into cooking because of Bashir. So I want to delve into a bit on this channel because it's related to health, it's related to fitness, it's all that stuff. And this is a simple thing that you can make at home, whether you're in college, whether you're still at home, whether you're out of college, whatever stage of life you're in, it's just a simple recipe. If you don't know how to make a breakfast burrito, welcome. This is how to make one, Bashir style. For a burrito. Yeah, I think the that memories. would be neato. Ah, <gasps> the memories. You're gonna be crying in no time. Oh, it's always so hot. First things first, gotta get out all the essentials. Gotta get Tyler here. What's up? <laughs> you can tell it's the morning by just looking at Tyler like. <laughs> well, the morning. <laughs> it's getting kind of late. <laughs> and Tristan here, vibing it out oh, this yeah. morning. I'm so tired. I need this coffee right now. <laughs> so we need a pan for cooking all the goods in. Cutting board. You need a good knife. You need a ceramic knife. Do um, you think we have enough peanut butter though? <laughs> we only have like seven jars, dude. Come on, chill out, bro. <laughs> Spices are like the biggest thing. This is the one thing that Bashir was telling me. If you guys know Bashir, you know he's a, he's a great chef, of course. You've seen him on my Instagram story, chefing it up. He was like, like nobody includes enough spice. But like, we're gonna freaking include enough spice. Okay, next. Eggs are an essential. At the end. Dude, I hope this cheese is good. Oh, it's so good. We should crush this. I'm 99% sure this cheese is good. <laughs> oh, shoot. That's not the best I've ever had. Mm -hmm. it's, not, it's not bad. It's not bad. <laughs> it's not bad. It's not bad. <laughs> it's not bad, but it kind of tastes like Play-Doh. <laughs> this is not an essential piece of it, but I like to crack a Capri Sun while we're doing this. Mmm, <sighs> 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 got the whole floor wet. My friend Josh was telling me that like he puts like soy sauce in his eggs and it's fire, so we'll try that out today. Hot sauce. Oh, butter. If you want anything to taste good, the secret is you just put some more butter in it. Okay, I know this looks like a lot, but really it's 40 spices, 3 <laughs> cheeses. things first is that you gotta get your potatoes in the pan because potatoes take like a super long time to cook. Ugh. Ugh. Tyler, come here, come here. Get your eye close to that. Mm. You're gonna be crying in no time. I'm gonna start the process because it's a long one. Throw a bunch of olive oil in. And then I'm gonna throw in a bit of butter. I always felt rushed cooking. Like, I was always like, oh my god, like I just have to do this so fast and all this stuff. But if you just add water, it boils off in the end. Mm. And it basically like makes it so you can cook slower. Okay, potatoes are soft. Salt and pepper. Ooh, that's... Okay. Little pepper. <laughs> Roasted herb and garlic by McCormick. And so now we kind of have it boiling in this vat of oils and seasoning and all that stuff and like hopefully the job of this is to like get the flavor into the potatoes uh, but now we just wait like it's just a waiting game now oh my gosh <sighs> now that's I get what I want lately been spinning up bag I did it to get in that can I did it to pop in them I'm actually really bad at cracking eggs so I oh my do we literally crush Half of an 18 rack in one meal. Sounds like Zach at night. <laughs> okay, so we're just gonna whisk up the eggs, but my friend Josh at UCSB was like, yo, dude, you gotta throw a little soy sauce in it. <laughs> I got Sharpie on it yesterday and I don't know what to do. Can you tell? Yeah. You can. <laughs> Turn the heat down because eggs cook way faster 
then the rest of this stuff. If we're from the south, there's no such thing as too much butter. Oh, it's That's always so hot. <laughs> I do not know how that happens. <laughs> We have a few less plates now. Oh, shit. What about that? Do we these need to go IKEA? Where are these from? <laughs> oh! Okay, Tyler's eating now. I can eat. <laughs> 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 no. Oh my god! Oh! <laughs> Tyler, first bite? How's it? Honest reviews Dang, only. Dang, it's actually pretty fire. Really? Like, dude, the soy sauce is it's pretty. It's actually good. pretty good. Dang, the reaction was so genuine. I actually like believe it. it Wait, no, it's good. Wait, that's like, so fun. I'm, I'm surprised. I'm surprised. <laughs> Tyler, you had them before. Come on. Dude, yep. It's actually really good. Dude. Mm. Ah! We could use some meat. Tyler, but it's good. Tyler, we're vegan, <laughs> except for that burger we ate last night, <laughs> and, and the eggs. But she was world famous burritos, obviously a smash hit. It's pretty simple, but I obviously made it a little bit complicated. Just be sure to spice it a lot. Be sure to start with the potatoes first, and you'll be set. I live a rock star lifestyle. I was getting with today's run. I think we're going for five miles. Something pretty easy. Yeah, That's I cool. guess I guess we get it running. Let's freaking do it. Five mile run with Tyler, first run in LA. Let's get a good one. Let's do it. it. <laughs> Tyler's confused on the directions. Trying to I literally could not get back right now. <laughs> it's been a long turn. <laughs> We're like right by his oh no, I'm, I'm taking us to Abikini, which is like a classic Venice road. Tons of shopping, all that stuff. Just to show Tyler, and then maybe we'll hit the beach. Yeah. And then we'll loop back around. And hopefully it'll come out your five bucks. in about four miles in a mile left we're gonna run over the venice canals show tyler the canals Solid five miles in the books. Obviously a beautiful run for the day. We finished it up, you know. Taking it easy, obviously, because you know we have a hard day tomorrow. We had a little bit of a medium day yesterday, so not too pressed on this one, but it was all about the sights. It was all about feeling good and just having fun, honestly. And, but we'll catch you soon. As usual, live happy, be healthy. Forget about you.